And now, your weather authority, Ron Young. Certified the most accurate forecast in the Arklatex. This has been an outstanding Monday, first day of the new work week, and tomorrow probably be just as good. Maybe a few more clouds and a sprinkle or two, and that's it. If you're looking at Bowie County Equipment, Skycam in DeKalb, Texas, and a lot of blue sky. And as we go through the 6 o'clock hour, we're going to see a pretty nice sunset across the area. Wind speeds, they've been up there today. 15 mile an hour steady winds right now in the Idabel Broken Bow area. 10 miles an hour in Texarkana, Shreveport, all the way into Magnolia. 14 miles an hour though as we go into Marshall. Everybody else less than 10 miles an hour. And in the last few minutes, we've had almost a 20 mile an hour gust, 19 miles an hour to be specific. That is in Texarkana. So it's going to be off and on windy conditions. And here is our high just to our north in the northern plains. It's going to move off to the east. We will see a southerly flow returning. Here's a little disturbance that could bring us a shower or two tomorrow. And way up here is our next weather maker. And it's not going to take long to get here by Thursday. In fact, let's go right ahead right now with your, uh, uh, come on now, change on me. Uh-oh, there we go. It was just a little stubborn. Robbie Story on our Futurecast, 7 a.m. tomorrow morning. We do see a few clouds uh, coming in. And if you blink, you'll miss it. A few showers here and there, 10, 20% chance, no thunder, not a biggie, but it will be cloudy as we go into your Tuesday, but we will salvage a day on your Wednesday, 7 a.m., clear skies. We've got a southeasterly flow for sure, but now watch this. That flow becomes stronger as high pressure off to the east and an approaching system from the west, and it really ramps up as we get into your Thursday, 7 a.m., in fact, some activity to our northwest, and here it comes. There's our cold front. Showers and thunderstorms from North Texas into Oklahoma, and they enter the Arklatex by 2 p.m. on Thursday. The front begins to, yep, intensifying a few storms as we go into the afternoon hours. But here we go. It's going to be hanging around. Look at the intensity here. Thursday, 9 p.m., then it's pretty much out of our area. Really intense storms as it heads to the east. So what does the seven-day forecast hold for us? Well, I'll show you in just a second, but right now, let's talk about severe weather. Right now, on day four, we are looking at Thursday with a slight risk of severe weather. And that is number two out of five being the highest. We certainly will be monitoring this closely. And as far as rainfall potential, right now, the uh, Weather Prediction Center has us day four, Thursday, in excessive rainfall, could get two inches or more across parts of the area. We certainly will be watching that as well because we don't need any heavy rain in the area. All right, 39 and 58 for tomorrow. We have Tuesday. Partly cloudy skies, a good looking Wednesday. Thursday, we have an 80% chance of showers and thunderstorms, especially in the late afternoon into the evening, 90% overnight. It goes down to just showers on your Friday, but those temperatures drop from 73 to 54. We go into the 30s in that extended forecast with afternoon high, struggling to get through the 50s, but it will be fantastic weather over your weekend. And we will be right back.